Okay, so now I am going to share um, a tray with you. This is a feather, and I wanted to try to make it look kind of like a bald eagle feather. And so that starts with very light at the bottom and works it way, its way up to very dark at the top. So I'm going to start with my pearl white. And I have also here camel brown. And I have here chocolate brown. And then I do have that, um, that gray I made up for Triton's hair and that bronzy light color I made up for the skin. So I might use one of those to help transition in, but we'll see because the, the eagle's feathers don't necessarily transition in, but they're very blunt. Um, so let's see what we can come up with. And I am going to just take my mica powders and fill in the little areas. And I'll put some music on and just continue. To mix my resin up and get that ready to pour in there. I hope that turns out as well as I think it is. Okay, I have my resin mixed up here for my feather and I want to put some color in there, just some light. I don't want to have the background um, oh, I'm transparent. I want it to be a little opaque. So let's get that mixed in there. And we're going to pour this high and slow because it needs to go down into all those crevices. you tomorrow and we'll take a peek at how this is doing. All right y'all it's day two and here's my feather. Um, this I think is the biggest thing I've made so far with resin. 
So I'm a little, I was a little intimidated to try it and I'm a little nervous to unmold it. But let's start pulling it back and just loosening those sides a bit right around this top area here. Pull the top part just loosen that back part Let's see if I can get that over the top without breaking it. Okay, I did. All right. it a little bit. That's why it's important for me, these bigger ones that I can demold before they're fully hardened. I can shape them if I need to. Okay. All right. No bubbles. Not on this side. Okay, are we ready? One, two, three. Oh, look at that. Oh my gosh. Oh, it turned out so beautiful. I love it. Oh, wow. Okay. And intimidation process is over. I am loving this. Oh, guys, let me know what you think. This is a good size. Um, this is a good size uh, mold. I can't even, I don't have a measuring tape down here. Um, but I will list how big it is, how big the finished product is. Um, Thank you so much for joining me for this process. It has been so much fun and a learning experience. Um, I will chat with you later. So guys, thank you so much for joining me today. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you've not subscribed, I hope you'll consider doing so now. As always, stay safe. God bless. Bye for now.